Stony Brook. Double clutches on a wide receiver screen of his own. And Tamari and Terry get lucky at USF. And now they went Wildcat a bunch last week with Cam Akers. And they're going to start off with the down to the big receiver. Third down and 15. Four-man rush for the Canes. Hornybrook into traffic. Almost picked off. That was right in the handle. Anybody off, let alone a true freshman. It's coming. Hornybrook avoids a sack. Can't get away, though. Eventually, the pocket collapses, and the Canes get him. Third down and a mile. Another sack for Miami as Hornybrook ends up buried by Greg Rousseau. Russo, they line him up over the center, they get him on the guard, and then his athleticism and strength on the delayed blitz by the, that there was not a slant thrown on this play. Barney Brook over the middle, reaching out to make the catch for the first. Get the press off if there is some, and then a quick little slant on the inside. Barney Brook, good ball placement. The quick hitter out to the edge. Keith Gavin makes the Barney Brook thought about a swing pass to Akers, and instead he's going to run for it. Dives for the first down marker. And he's goosing. No one's there. I got a feel. Let me find this open space. Now it's Akers. Bottled up behind the line and thrown down. Trayvon Hill gets a tap. Brook motioning back into the backfield into a pistol formation in front of Akers. And he's out of the pocket again. Slings one down the sideline. Climbing the ladder. Got these guys, these athletes up in the middle. Hornybrook. Pressure coming. Ball batted around that middle screen out there for Trayshawn Harrison. On 15, you're going to have two high safeties and man-to-man -man coverage. The blitz, the crosser is McKitty. To have six get the ball on a wildcat. Instead, it's Akers right up the middle on a dive. I don't think he got there. Trayvon Hill comes out looking for answers to run their program and haven't found them. Hornybrook under pressure. The Miami pass rush gets home again. Selves in positive yardage positions and picking up for the first down so they can use their tempo. Well, there goes Akers. That's the first. A commitment to get Akers the football to start off the third. Miami comes with a rush. Popped up in the air and on the carom it may have been intercepted. Bubba Bolden has the loose ball. The turnover chains cover them in the moment. Yeah, they've been covered in both situations. Screen pass, Akers to the sideline. Looking for the pylon. He's got it. Horny Brooks swings one out to labor. Puts his foot in the ground and makes a man miss. Oh, what a cutback by the red shirt sophomore. Is lined up to take the direct snap. He'll throw one out to Hornybrook. Hornybrook may have had a knee on the ground. He scoots down the sideline. This time a zone read for Akers. And he is met in the backfield and wrapped up. And he goes nowhere. Pat Bethel was able to make the stop. And a ton of two high safety, man-to-man -man coverage underneath. Two things. You want a screen or an outbreaking route to take advantage of leverage. Hornybrook in trouble. And he goes down. Russo in the back field again he has been unblockable the last couple of weeks they try to cut 55 on the left side cut him Rousseau swipes at him never goes down to the ground and Alex Hornybrook never had it Hornybrook he has been under siege all day by that Miami defensive line and he goes down again Hornybrook Another little shovel pass over the middle, but tumbling down was neighbors couldn't hold on to it, and there's a flag. This comes a little bit more to me about some play calling and, and stopping or staying out of third and 15 plus. Here comes the rush again, and down he goes again. Tripped up by guess who? Greg Rousseau. Four sacks for Gregory Rousseau. You're doing one thing. Here comes a pass, and Rousseau, another nice job by Manny Diaz of... Under six minutes to go. Akers, bottled up, lost about a yard.